Hello, everybody. <laughs> How is everybody doing? I am so sorry for being late. Wow, the promise, the promise. Eh. Hold on, I gotta. There. All right, look, 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 chat. Let me explain. <laughs> hello, Blue. Hello, Syrinx. Hello, Flossie. How's everybody doing today? Hey, Moon. Let, look. All right, just a recap of the last half hour. <laughs> so, I was like, oh man, I have half an hour to prep. That's amazing. So I started opening up all my programs. And I'm like, you know what I could do though? I could grab myself a snack. So I grabbed myself a little square of boat de kook, which is like a Dutch butter cake. It's like a... I don't know how to describe it. So I'm like, okay. I'm going to eat that and then I'm going to get like prep up. I have all my programs open already. And then all of a sudden my brain just has a moment of... What is an arquebus? And why do I need to know about it? That second part doesn't matter. It's time to read. So I hop over and go onto Google and Google Archibus and go just start reading. And then five minutes go by. And then 10 minutes go by. And then 15 minutes go by. And then 20 minutes go by. And I have not noticed. <laughs> I'm just casually reading through this article of information. Then all of a sudden, I get a message on Discord. And all of a sudden, I register the time. And I have like one minute. <laughs> and I'm like, oh, what the heck happened? No! <laughs> and <laughs> that's when it began. Quickly make tweet quickly start like prep open up game prep stream try to make sure that everything is locked in place do the thing do the thing do the thing start stream make sure that the name is correct all the other stuff and i'm like but i need tea shit so i rush over to go make tea no water in the kettle pour water into the kettle ah i need to use the bathroom really quickly all right well kettle can boil well whatever what and then it's like check again okay peeps are in gotta let them know that i'm gonna be a second rush back pour myself a cup of tea and there's a single grain of rice in it. I don't know where the rice came from. But a single grain of it was in my tea. <laughs> Hello, Don. <laughs> Hello, Frozen Scarecrow. Rice tea. That must, have be, must be what it is, Syrinx. And then I rush back over again and... Realize that I haven't eaten my freaking Botakook yet. So now it's just going to stare at me this entire stream. Reminding me <laughs> that it's there. And that I can't eat it while on stream. <sighs> How's your guys' day going? <laughs> and also, I'm glad to hear that, Flossie. I'm sorry to hear that life is only about kicking right now. I hope that things aren't going too badly for you. Other than that, I'm doing well. Thank you for asking. Just needed to get my story out for a moment. <laughs> and I was like, man, I'm gonna have topics that I want to talk about and all this other stuff. And then just that chaos happened and now I have no idea what the heck I wanted to talk about anymore. Also, I forgot to turn on that freaking table thing. Where is it? One moment. Memory table. There we go. Huh. <sighs> and yeah, how's everybody doing? I hope that so far your Monday and Tuesday have treated you well. I hope that your weekend was really good.
Is that what it is, Syrinx? You know what? I suppose we should all hope for that. <laughs> that that flossy. Kicked a bunch of butts. Uh, and, uh... The assault on small children. <laughs> the scream I scrimped. Ah. <sighs> But yes, we are back in Titanfall today. I am excited. I hope that you're excited. Ugh. Sorry. I'm a little bit spaced now. It's fun being in a in a strange state to be able to get over Ugh, oh, to get overwhelmed easily. Hello, Stitches, how are you doing? What, do you not have enough points to do the knock knocks today? Have all the points been spent? Or are you playing with my emotions right now? <laughs> are you playing the long con so that I'm like, oh. He's not going to do the thing that he normally does. Only to subvert my expectations later. Oh, it's going to be Pom Pom instead. Knock, knock. Who's there? <gasps> Is that Pom Pom? Someone let Pom Pom in. My goodness. It is nippy outside. Used all my points on the other day on the polls. Oh, no. <laughs> I lost it all at the track. It's all gone now. We can't let Pom Pom in the house. She ruins the furniture. Does she, though? I don't recall a time when that was a thing for Pom Pom. Unless there's this particular reference here that I don't understand. But hello, Pom Pom. How are you? I hope that work is treating you well at the, mo uh, at the moment. And cat spray. Isn't that only one of the... How to say it, one type of, or what, how to say it, one gender of cat that sprays? And isn't that males? I think. Maybe I'm wrong on that. As you see via bottle. Ah, I see. I see what you're saying. <laughs> Females too just rare. Oh, I didn't know that. I did not. That's actually a new thing that I've learned today. Thank you, Dorn. <laughs> I love that everybody gets their own custom uh, gif and response. Gif? Emotes? There you go. That was the correct word. I don't know why I went to gif. Oh, Sorry, my brain's a mess right now. <laughs> Jokes on you, Pom Pom. If Frozen Scarecrow is in fact frozen, then you're just spraying more water on him, thus increasing his power. He cannot be stopped. <laughs> My brain looks great. I blue. I don't know what that means, but I'm worried about it. Oh, it's a point. Jesus. Stitches, I thought you pointed a gun at Flossie for a second. Like, no, not Flossie. We like Flossie. Captions, why did you write both Flossie and Flossie? Oh, and now you're not going to do it anymore, huh? Bring out the fu- Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Here's where it all goes to heck. So who the heck is that? Oh, Pom Pom, you have a new emote. Look at that little guy go. Oh, no. Ah. <laughs> <sighs> 
goodness, apologies for all this, uh, for all the exhales. Brain is just a little... It's the only way I can describe it. There's not words for it. It's only a sound. <laughs> Actually, this is going to be interesting because I don't remember any of the controls. It's been a hot minute. It's been like two weeks since we last played this, so... Uh, the muscle memory is going to be a very key component. My brain usually just sounds to... My brain is usually just sounds to... I feel ya. I feel ya. Put you back down. Also, uh, since we're waiting for a second for the game to load, fun fact: apparently, the arquebus, which is a so is a firearm, an old, uh, I think it's fifteen sixteen hundreds firearm. Uh, apparently, it its name is derived from the Dutch term uh, hackbus. Which is which means like hook gun. So it actually like the uh, even though the the weapon itself is very how to say um, I just think that's it just uh, will have the yep 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 yeah you know what's more easier than saying words correctly is saying them incorrectly. Um, it's just neat that the that there's just that shenanigans where it's like, oh, this is actually derived from a Dutch word. Yay, even though I always presumed it was French just because arquebus, an arquebusier. I just always presumed it was French for some reason. Two weeks, that's one more week than the popular... <sighs> I can't believe you did this to me, Syrix. I first thought you were going to take a, to say, go in a different direction. Also, hey, Bells, how's it going? Are you winning, son? Uh, we just started. I was late, because shame on me, but that's okay. I don't know why that made me LOL so hard. <laughs> I mean, should you question why you, uh, why you got a good laugh from something and instead just enjoy the laughs? All right. I recommend you meet me at the rings in order to scan the Ark's energy signature. I have, like, no recollection. Oh, it is middle mouse click. Okay, we're gonna have to remember that, because that's important. Oh, is that how many mag- Triox, how's it going? Long time no see. I am so sorry, by the way, for missing the streams lately. I've been trying, but when you already have, when you have like four streams up, eventually it's just, you're just like, uh, I don't even know who I'm watching anymore. <laughs> Well, long time no see, buddy. How's it going? I hope that the week has been treating you well so far, despite the fact that we're only on Tuesday. Welcome, welcome. Thank you so much for stopping by. Oh. My god, I gotta stop the huhs. I'm doing too many huhs. There's a limited amount. Streams are kind of like PG-13 movies, where you're allowed to have... A certain, in th that one case, you're only allowed to have, like, one swear word somewhere. In the case of streaming, you can have an X amount of exhales. And I've already done too many exhales. Who was <laughs> I don't know the reference, but scary. <laughs> Alright, quick sip of water, and then we begin, we begin our little adventure. The movie Scent of a Woman? Is that, like, that's like, wait, there's a movie called Scent of a Woman? Let 
There's a psi ghost in your lungs and it's trying to get out. Well, Pom Pom, the question that here is, uh, medical diagnosis wise, am I trying to get it out? Or am I trying to keep it in? <laughs> Oi, why are you being a butt phone? I am attempting to really quickly do. Women are real. <laughs> Immediate panic. Eh, eh, uh, Sense of a Woman, 1992. It's a drama, apparently fairly well received in certain regards. Frank is a retired lieutenant colonel in the U.S. Army. He's blind and impossible to get along with. Charlie is at school and is looking forward to going to college. To help pay for a trip for Christmas, he agrees to look after Frank over Thanksgiving. Frank's niece says this will be easy money, but she uh, didn't reckon on Frank spending his Thanksgiving in New York. Well, there you go. That's the, that's the premise for the movie. Trying to coax it out, but it's shy and keeps it going back. Ah, I see. Women are real? I thought they were just an urban legend, and that's what I thought too, especially women on the internet. Oh, God. What's a woman? <laughs> What's happening? Hey, Solarcy, how's it going? You came in just as we were questioning whether or not women are real. Uh, do you have any inputs, Larcy? Also, welcome. How are you? I hope that your week is going well so far. <laughs> you know, we all have our opinions here. Uh, hmm, as a woman, I can't be too sure, right? That's that's where it gets really complicated because now you're sitting in like a weird situation of like a Descartes, you know, like you're pondering your own existence and you're just like, well, I do think. So theor so logically, I do am, but do I be do? <laughs> Can't see it, but I have a, uh, a hand over my face right now in just <laughs> pure embarrassment of to what I just said. It's going to be a good stream, I think. Don't you think? <laughs> you know what? Let's let's move forward. I think that's the correct thing to do here. Uh Oh. Game. You gave me the you gave me the allowance to do certain things. Alright, we begin. Hey, Vitrify, how's it going? We just started. I need to change my defaults. Get hacked. <laughs> my brain just always goes to just like, I hope everybody's having a good day. And it's just like, yes, you've already said that six or seven times. But hello, Vitrify. How are you doing? I hope that your day is going well so far. I hope that your week is treating you well. Good night, little fella. Were there still boys? Oh, there were lots of boys. Oh, Jesus. I thought... 
All I could see was just that suddenly, and I was like so convinced that some kind of freaking tendril. Oh my god, Dead Space is still fresh in my brain, clearly. I thought some tendril was gonna burst through that window and just drag me away. Just, no, no, not again! <laughs> Oh, goodness. Has anyone ever... Has anyone been as far as to decide to go use even want to look more alike? Syrinx, I remember a time when I could quote that flawlessly without a hiccup, without a pause. I could just do that. Vitrify, did you know... Yeah, exactly. Vidi, do you know that... Uh, I mean, Vitrify... No one can prove that I said the thing that I just said. Did you know that, uh, that women are real? It says so in this very... In this, uh... Well-acclaimed... Research paper. So I'm sorry to say, but it's true. And you're gonna have to believe it, because otherwise... Something, something, something. I'm pretty sure I'm clear, but I just wanna check, because I don't wanna miss anything. Can I, uh, my source, uh, yeah, just let me immediately end stream. <laughs> or alternatively, I can quote the one stupid video. My source is that I made it the fuck up. <laughs> there's a helmet. And I'm gonna find it. Unless there's no helmet in here, in which case I am, uh, completely incorrect. Pilot, I have located the controls to extend the bridge oh. to the rings. I have marked it on your HUD. It appears that whatever actions you took in the past have caused the remaining automated security systems to be quite hostile towards us in the present. Oh dear. Well, can you do something about it? Yeah, like that. Exactly like that. Hey, not the big boss. How's it going? How are you? How are you? How? Oh my goodness, such dramatic music. Oh, what? What? Uh. Okay. I'm gonna need a second to process that I just walked out of Titan unintentionally. <laughs> That's pretty funny, but it's pretty hard to justify on time. <laughs> I suspect so, by the sound of it. Sorry, I want to drink this tea, but I can't. And I'm also now afraid of downstairs. Uphold the mission. I have marked the bridge controls on your HUD. You will need to extend the bridge before the fold weapon test pad explodes. Hmm. Well, that didn't do anything, did it? Oh my god, I'm not even dead. Oh, hello, friends! Why don't you come on down here? Oh no. What? I totally hit him in the back. I totally hit him in the back! Fine. You want to play this card game? I think they were about right here. Ow! <laughs> well, I tried. Four more days of overtime shift to make up for the long weekend. Oof! That's rough, dude. That whatever actions you took in the Sorry to hear that. Have caused the remaining automated security systems to be quite hostile towards us in the present. Wait, 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 wait. wait, wait. Pilot control initiated. 
denied like this. Oh, I see. <gasps> I can time travel! I didn't know I could time travel in this thing! Oh my god, that changes everything! you are. We're taking hull damage. We're getting shot. Firing. First floor ready. Ooh. Hi. Ion. No, I wanted to. I actually wanted to read that. We have funny thing. We were talking about the most economic way to build a lightweight anti-personnel mech. <laughs> An interesting topic, to be certain. So we have the block and return fire. We've got a laser shot, a precise shoulder laser. We have a laser-tripped explosive mine, and our V is a heavy chest-fired la- Ooh, that sounds fun. Now there's nothing to kill! What am I gonna do? Dramatic music! I've located the controls to extend the bridge to the rays. I have marked it on your hut. Maybe built the 15 on the aluminum chassis. Hold on, aluminum chassis and carbon fiber Kevlar armor and it's hut and it's hybrid. I'm not sure what you mean by hybrid in terms of like fuel. Like it uses a mixture of a of uh, of combustion and uh, electric. Gas and battery. Yeah, exactly. The hell was the safety protocol? Initiate the test immediately. Oh dear. Copy that. Do not allow the intruder to reach the arc under any circumstances. Oh god, so we caused this. Wait, what? Okay. I don't know how to activate that. All right, let's go then. I'm to say this works better as a two person. Oh god, never mind, this is not a two-person situation! Let me back in! Possible to the center of the rings. Uh, V. V. Ah! <laughs> oh wow, that goes on for a while, eh? Oh, I need those batteries something bad. Oh, what is happening? That's probably bad. BT. Hey, Fate, how's it going? Oh. Oh. Is this a bad thing? This seems bad. 
One second, Syrinx. I'll read in a second. I'm, uh... I'm just trying to figure out what's going on at the moment. Wow. He's got that look of, like... Ooh. Gonna feel this one on Monday. ba da ba ba da ba Dude's also straight, straight gone. Ah. Oh, we're making our way to the core. Hello, core friend. Stable host, running, scanning. Is this good? Is this good? Is this bad? I don't know. Well done, pilot. Scan complete. As Anderson discovered, the IMC intend to destroy the militia planet of Harmony using the full-scale version of this weapon. Pilot Cooper, our journey is far from over. We must get this data to the fleet. One, I didn't find the helmet. And two, wait, is that cool superpower gone forever now? I think it is. That's very sad, because I was really digging it. Alright, sorry. Catching back up on chat. Let's see here. We got the best. The best way to make an anti-personnel mech is to make it so every time you see one, you get sucked into a corporate phone call that you could have been. That could have been a meeting, and you can't hang up. People will run for their lives. <laughs> Sounds like a terrible thought this was Titanfall because you can do parkour in Titanfall not the big boss all right unless oh, secretly I've just been I'm just playing two parkour games right now that's really what's happening all right pilot Cooper Anderson is dead but we can complete his mission if we can re-establish contact with the fleet hell yeah we the can stellar beacon ahead will serve our needs Let's hope someone on our side is listening out there. There is only one way to find out. We yes, must right. uphold the mission. Checking area. Fade, no need to stab people. That's no good. We use our words to talk things out. Oh, that's edge of map crap. Okay, I'm not supposed to be going this way. Thanks, game. Alright. Still gonna try to look out for more of I see the beacon up ahead. He sees the beacon up ahead. Wait. There's nine pilot helmets in this map. Oh good lord. Maybe I won't go down Scans the pilot map. Minimal power functionality. It may need repairs. Caution, I'm picking up multiple contacts. Well, then why do you keep walking? Let me at least catch up with you, you silly lad. Ow, the my blood. Confirmed. The stalkers appear to be programmed to attack the control room. Oh, he's just going right away, eh? But I just need to do a Caution. little looking. I detect traces of poisonous chemicals within the fog. Oh. What is this fog? 
scanning. The ground fog is a toxic byproduct of the beacon power grid. I recommend you embark when operating in hazardous environments with greater than one ppm tungsten hexafluoride. Embark and we will move out, pilot. I think I have to embark. I don't think that they're giving me much of an option. But also, new gun. Pilot, I'm detecting militia forces inside that beacon control room. They are signaling distress. Patching in. Hold on, what do we got here? Reduce damage from incoming fire. Slows and damages. G is a quick directional phase. And a broadsword. Well. Hey! You out there! Pilot! Are you reading us? We can use some help over here! This is Captain Cole for the third militia grenadiers! We're getting overrun by stalkers! Please assist! I recommend we help eliminate these stalkers and then make direct contact with the militia riflemen. Oh man, they've got a freaking holdout going on. Tactical option. Run them over. My 40 ton chassis can eliminate smaller enemies. Oh. Alright. I mean, I don't see. Wait, you actually have a specific weight? 40 tons? That's quite a. It's quite the meaty lad, as it were. Just shoot a shotgun into a window. Well done. This victory has raised our combat efficiency rating. Pardon? BT-7274 to militia forces. All threats have been eliminated. Yeah. You saved our asses. Those stalkers just kept on coming. We may not have lasted much longer. As is We're in every game. Doors. Come on in. Wait, is it safe to even get out here? God, I hope so. Is it gonna raise while we're standing? On the lift. McCord, bring him up. Let's go. Right away, sir. Captain, what is the status of the beacon? The power is shut down. We've lost all control of the beacon. We need something like this to jumpstart the system, but this one's destroyed. Designation: Arc Tool. Function: Generates power up to five megajoules. Yeah, yeah, we know what it is. Can you repair it? Nah, we already tried. Sensors indicate another one in the substation, but it's... Have yourself a good rest. Uh, Stitches, I hope that you feel better soon. Also, we're not stabbing, Pom-Pom. Don't you do it. It's really impossible to get down there. This place just ain't built for humans. Understood. Pilot Cooper, I advise caution while navigating this facility substation. You must recover the arc tool. Good luck, sir. Hope you make it back. We've lost too many down there. Taking out Demeter was a huge victory for us. Why doesn't it feel that way? Well, the Demeter fleet was only about a third of the IMC presence on the frontier. Still, every little victory counts. You have the fullest half glass I've ever seen. Yeah, those stalkers just kept... I like that line. You have the fullest half glass I've ever seen. That's a good... That, that's a really solid bit of writing. Seems like we're sta seems like we're stabbing to me. No pom pom, no stabbing. That pilot and that Titan showed up. They didn't build this place expecting humans to hit the buttons. Nothing but programmed drones in charge down here. I heard someone been killing off Lisk's team. Give me the mercenaries. Excuse me? I'm going into another area now. Oh good god. I didn't even get the nine from the other area. I didn't even get a chance to explore it. Vitrify, if you happen to still be in chat, um, do I get to go back there? Do I get to go and explore that a little bit more? If only they had actual world building behind lines like that. I mean, this game is, like, building a really nice world from what I can tell. Like, I'm digging the, the world and the surroundings and the, how to say it, just the, how to say it, the, 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 I guess the story of it all that's happening at the moment. And granted, these are all, like, people who don't come from this world, too, right? So they're bringing completely different things into this area. Oh, hello, friend. Well. Small 
Guess we're going in. Careful, people. These stalkers can come out of the walls. Stay alert. Excuse me. Seal this place off and be dumb. Ugh. Yeah, that's your answer to everything, Barry. It looks like they can turtle up to protect their heads. That's why they're so hard to kill. Wish I could tell you what's down there, but whatever it is, we're hoping you can handle it, pilot. I'm hoping I can handle it too. And I get what you're saying, but let me ask you a question as always: Why? Why is anyone doing the things they are? Uh, at the moment, uh, they're hunkering down while trying to get. Da, 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 da. Trying to find a way to fix or get a new version of the whatchamacallit. Because I can't for the life of me know why the IMC exists or the militia is fighting them. War stuff. <laughs> also, I am not the right person to ask that question because I can't remember who's who or what who and who stands for. I'm very bad at the names. Last pilot in our unit went that way a few hours ago, but he never came back. Careful. We're doing our best down here. I feel like jumping on that is going to send me into a fan. So that's not the way I need to go right now. Pilot, I have patched into your helmet display to monitor your progress. The channel is open if you need assistance. No. BT, what's up with these walls? Scanning. Exposed power circuits. You should avoid physical contact. Proceed forward with caution. Got it. And B. BT, remind me what I'm doing here. Your mission is to obtain an arc tool. Using it, we can jumpstart the power systems and get the beacon back online. Scans detected signature further within this facility substation. Whoop. Well done. Uh, I tried looking it up. It's a lot of resource and uh, oppression, but there isn't a whole lot of elaboration from that point on. Fair enough. Sometimes in stories like this, it is definitely just like, who's that? That's the bad guy. Who's that? That's the good guys. Why are the bad guy? Why are they the bad guys? Oppression or something. Stealing resources. <laughs> just like, why are they the good guys? Because they're the ones who are getting the resources stolen. Ah. Special under? No. Uh, it's kind of like watching New Hope and saying, why is the Empire or even the Rebels good? Yeah, exactly. I suppose it depends on your view. Though I feel like, how to say, like the Empire in some regard makes sense that they're... I mean, this gets into a whole thing, but they're a very militant, you know, very, you know, like people don't like a rule, put a boot on their neck kind of attitude. Uh, it always takes me out of a medium if, say, good guys and bad guys. Although, Avatar, I feel like the exception is if somebody is like, um, how to say, is having a moment where they're trying to convince themselves. Or like, you know, like friendly banter. It's just like, what do you mean, dude? We're the good guys. You know, I feel like in that case, if it's a character that... Ooh. Like, I don't disagree with you, Avatar, but I feel like there are exceptions to that rule, but I feel like I'm being pedantic. Pedantic? Pedantic? But... You know what I'm saying. Okay, so that, this spot, no. That spot, yes. <laughs> it makes sense when it's self-aware. Ah, there you go. establish what's going on. True. There is still I I mean 
I want to like rebuttal, but I feel like I haven't watched the old Star Wars in so long that I can't just simply be just like, well, actually this. Some strategy. Wait, what are you guys yelling about now? Have the rebels tried not having such bootable things? <laughs> oh god, Syrinx. That idea. Cause like, you know, like boots on neck or like boots on ground is one thing, but like bootable also has the idea of like puntable. And the idea of a puntable neck. Like somebody just laying on the ground and then there's somebody walks by and they just see their their neck and they're just like sweating because they can't decide if they want to go for that that kick or not. Just <laughs> the idea of getting kicked in the throat. Uh in the same vein, Titanfall 2 has the first has the first game and also a three minute cutscene at the start. What was the cutscene at the start again, Vitrify? I believe it was. What is it? Essentially just like this is you know, this is so and so. This used to be our place before the IMC like tore it apart. This is what we're fighting for. So hold on. I have my setup a little bit incorrect. There we go. Also, I'm out of bullets for one gun already, so that's not great. <laughs> Can I take this? And we're taking out... Ooh. Game, I have a pretty good idea of how I need to approach this, but sure, let's see what he does. Yeah, so exactly how I would approach it. Uh, we're taking out the bad guys, ideologically unchanged protagonists. But Avatar, would you feel better if, um, you know, because usually the response to that is usually just like, so what are we, what are we supposed to do? And then it's, you know, like the lock and load moment of just like, take out some bad guys. What if they just responded with, you know, just like, kill some people? <laughs> Would that make it better or worse for you? Oh boy. Oh dear. Yep, 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 yep. I didn't jump good. I'm bad at jumping. Alright, this one's the one. For all the beans in the cupboard. <laughs> Nailed it. It's a maze down here. How deep does this thing go? Scans reveal a maximum depth of 300 meters. Oh. What is this place? The station's computer details this location as the power grid for an IMC interstellar beacon. Oh no. Nope! Clinging on to life. <laughs> there we go. Alright, we're in. We're in, ladies and gentlemen. Less exciting than I thought it was going to be. Oh dear. And there's no... Hey! What if I wanted to backtrack? I know what I need to do. It doesn't look like there's any things. It's better when people refer to uh, to the antagonizing oppressed forces as they are. 
Oh, I see. Just like take out some IM or IMC scum or whatever. Sensors detect a power control room located at the top of the silo. The fan exhaust is non lethal. Wait, so I'm just supposed to just fly? There's a climbable section? Ah. Nope. Okay, give it to me. Thank you. Active grenade launcher it is. Wait. I swear I saw an activation thing. Oh, it is just literally shut down the turbine. Successful. The fan exhaust is offline. Do not be afraid. Your jump kit can take that fall. Oh, when you have to range combat with a shotgun. Better the shotgun than not, I suppose. Alright. Okay, wait, can we even land on that? That looks really warm. I know that I'm supposed to be looking for that thing, but there's also a button here. Oh, interesting game. Do very good. Oh. Am I supposed to wait for it to deactivate? Yep, I was. <laughs> come up this way. Hey. Oh, this was the wingman when it still used heavy ammunition. That is the correct one, isn't it, Vitrify? This is wingman, this is the now uses sniper rounds. Sorry, little buddy. Although I feel like you don't know how to use this thing. Because you're just kind of like, and click. I'm sorry. Oh no, he's sad! Oh no! <laughs> I feel terrible now. <laughs> Hold on, sorry, I just missed a couple messages. Give you an example. Tribes Ascent. Oh my god, I haven't played Tribes Ascent in like 15 years. I don't know how old that game is anymore, but I remember playing it in high school. Um, now the tribes have little to zero plot at the best of times, but you know what infuriated me about the universe? The radio calling the other guys butchers and sand rakers. Just a few voice lines told me so much what motivation or informed, sorry, misunder, misread, misread. Just a few lines and inform me of the motivations and why. Ah, I see what you're saying. Okay, now where the heck was I supposed to go again? I'm supposed to go here. I just don't know where. Oh, you're never 
never gonna make me reach there. What the fuck? Nope. I did that. It's true, Blue. I did do this. I am digging the games, how to say. Like, it. it's just adding these... How to say it? It has a little bit of, like, a Nintendo feel to it, in a way. Oh. Nintendo feel to it. Specifically in the sense of it gives you a tool, or it lets you go through a level, gets to a point, gives you a new tool to let you go back through the level to learn how to approach that tool, and then gives you a bunch of challenges with the said tool in order to, or gimmick, mechanic, however you want to pronounce it. was actually the wrong way to go. Learning exactly. taught me that these things Why are all of them not freaking holding these? Now granted, you can't hold a lot of ammunition for it, but still, there's a big boy gun. It's me, guys! Now that was impressive, pilot. Oh, thank We're you. waiting for you back in the control room. Bang! That's not in the pilot handbook. That's not in the pilot handbook. <laughs> ah, quips. Good to see you back here safely, pilot. Bang? What? What? I didn't do anything. I'm feeling attacked right now. I didn't do anything. You're the bad guy. Wow, Avatar. Way to just paint me with a broad brush in order to establish that you're the protagonist. <laughs> Good work, Pilot Cooper. Now we can jumpstart the power to get the beacon functional. Cable secure, Captain. Glad you made it back, Cooper. J 
just in time to assist me from wire. Now all we need is some power. All right. There's a great example of showing that stuff is happening while you were gone. You know? The two pipes are being put in place. You know, like, BT is working on things. You just, all of a sudden, you're just like, oh, well, I've been down there slogging through troops and learning this new tool. On the surface, they've been prepping for the presumption that I'm going to be okay. Which I like. Avatar was the protagonist. My brush is about as wide as a push broom. <laughs> Protagonists can be bad. The power chamber relays are offline. The arc tool should be able to jump stop them manually. Cooper, let's hope that arc tool was worth all the trouble. Oh dear. I'm going back. Caution. High radiation levels detected ahead. Your suit will only protect you for a limited time inside the chamber. I suggest you move quickly. Oh! I stay in there too long unless you want to be burnt to a crisp. Okay, opening the hatch in three, two... Really? We're only going to talk about that radiation gives you that? Not going to mention the, uh... Shutter's a good idea. Uplink targeting module. Reset initiated. Oh, what is falling out of the sky? 70%. What's going on? Talk to me. Not sure. Some sort of fail safe. Yeah. Captain, the uplink targeting module is offline. Not good. I bet the IMC are on their way. That is a reasonable assumption. Cord, can we bypass the module? No, sir. Not unless we want to send a message to the entire IMC fleet. Then the module is going to have to be repaired manually. And that's going to be us. This situation could use your skills. I hope you're up for another trip to hell, Cooper. You'll need to repair the beacon on site and get back here as fast as possible. Wait, does Cooper know anything about like repairs? Or is this more just like, hey, we can walk you through it. We just need you to get up there first. I'll presume it's that one. We've already lost a lot of good soldiers over there. I'll presume it's that one. Ooh. Oh, wait, I'm not sure what those are then. Are those just like, is it just meteors? Is that all we're like, all that they Scans are? indicate a fallen pilot. My memory recalls this pilot as an exceptional fighter, proven well during the fracture operation. What's fracture? Fracture was the code name of a major combat refueling operation conducted by the militia on the planet Victor. We sustained many casualties, but the fleet survived. Damn. Was it a Pyke victory? Or, because you're talking about how we lost a lot of people. We already lost a lot of good soldiers uh, there. I see that you can see me because... <laughs> I see that you sent me here because I don't know any better. Well, no, Avatar, don't forget, we're considered a pilot. We're like, how to say it, I guess like an elite tier soldier. So it's one of those like, yeah, I mean, we sent a lot of like... Like, a lot of grunts, apparently. Like, we sent a lot of grunts. We sent, like, 50 grunts. But, like, you'll probably be fine. You'll do well. You want to know why? Because you're the protagonist. Sorry, I'm just curious if I can find any, uh... Helmets up here. 
I'm pretty sure I need to just go inside, but we're going to do a quick scan just in case. The professional antagonist. I spy one. We're going after it, ladies and gentlemen. You got that plot armor, baby! This is definitely a benefit of being the protagonist. Hold on, is there even a way to get over there? Or am I doing a fool's errand right now? Because you can jump pretty high, but I don't think I can jump that high. This might be one of those I can't get there yet. Probably need to turn these somehow. Alright, we'll leave him for now. I want to make a game where there's clearly a protagonist, but you're not it. There's a game called The Bard's Tale. It was on the PS2. I don't know if it was for other stuff, but it was like a comedy, kind of like how to say it. It was a top-down, uh, kind of semi-hack-and-slash RPG. And it was had, like, comedy elements where your character's given the title of Chosen One, and they're just like, don't give me that garbage. Like, don't call me stuff like that. But then, like, along the way, you'll find, like, other chosen ones who have died in, like, horrific ways. And these little fellas will pop out and sing about how they died because they were supposed to be. Oh, how the heck does that song go again? Oh, it's bad luck to be you. The prophecy is never coming true. <laughs> When your life has run amok, you can see that you're the schmuck. Oh, it's bad luck to be you. <laughs> I love Morrowind. I was not referring to Morrowind, but I'm glad you love Morrowind. Wait, why did we... My scans detect a functioning uplink targeting module, 428 meters northeast. My analysis indicates a throw is our only option here. Oh. I can throw you across the gap. Oh. Are you sure about this? There is a 68% chance of success. <laughs> there you go. What about the other 32%? Yeah, what about the other 32%? There is a 32% chance of an incomplete traversal. Resulting in catastrophic trauma, massive internal bleeding, and multiple compound fractures. Dismemberment may also occur. There is also the possibility of electrocution and disintegration within the toxic fog below. He's really selling it, eh? Really letting me know that if we oopsie daisy. Look. I know we're going to make it. I just want that helmet first. And I don't know how to do it. Wait, unless this can actually rise up. Because it looks like it's an elevator of some sort. Standing up. By, pilot. Climb onto my hand. Yeah, 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 yeah. Fine. Fine game. Fine. Is he going to do the little point? Yes, he is. Wind. Three knots, heading 274, range 95 meters, projectile mass. Hey, Lunella, we're about to get thrown by a robot. Yeah. Yeet. Ah! Good throw. You're welcome, pilot. Good luck over there. Richter, this is Blisk. Yeah, here's Richter. Oh, Richter. Trying to use the beacon. End this. I'm counting on you. Let's go out. All security units, this is Richter. Get to the beacon now. Find the kleiner Mann and lass mich nicht hängen. Copy that. Zulu 1 Kilo 1, move in. Alpha 2, get soldiers on ground. Move it! Interesting that the, quote, bad guys happen to have... <laughs> German. A German guy. Also, Avatar, did you, uh... Did you catch what he was saying there? And also, thank you, Lunella, for bringing chaos into my home. <laughs> All right. 
Let's get a timer. There it is. No, because I'm at work. D d do you forget how German works when you're at work? <laughs> That's what I do best. <laughs> Very well, Lunella. You get Dutch for five minutes, starting in three, two, one. Dus. Nederlands. Kunnen we het spreken? Ja. Oh, dat is, uh, dat is waar. Dat is waar, Avatar. Hey, dat ruimt een klein beetje. Maar ja, dus we gaan gewoon door. Door de deur. Door de deur, deur. Deze kant op. En we zullen zien wat iedereen erover he over heeft te, te bedenken. Want ik kan het al horen. Bels en blauw en maan gaan allemaal... Kun je... Kun je uh... Het is waar avatar. Mm. <laughs> ah, en alsjeblieft. <laughs> Stroopwafel. Oh, wauw. Ze dus laten je gewoon niet eens verder gaan. Het is gewoon... Hier moet dit naartoe. Dit is gewoon een klein beetje uh, werk om je bezig te houden. Ja, man. Je leert wat Nederlands. Dat is mooi. IMC dropships headed to your location. Huh? Oh, nee. <gasps> Hallo? Ik zag je. Open alsjeblieft. Oké. Okay. Wie is daar? Hallo? Oh, oh nee. Oh. How are you getting that? Oh, sorry. Nee, ik zei geen Nederlands. Ik zei geen Engels. Ik zat gewoon in mijn hoofd. In mijn hoofd. Oh, god. Hoe kwam hij weer eens omhoog? Dat is wat ik zei. Jullie hoorden het. Nee, nee, iedereen hoorde het. En dank u wel voor het, voor het drinken. Ah, uh, man. Kom maar binnen dan. Hm? Doe er iets om. Kun je niet. Open. Oh nee. Wat in de wereld gaat dit doen? Oké, okay, we gaan het proberen. Oh, we springen gewoon in het gevecht. Mooi. Oh, dat ging goed. En jij weg. Wacht eens even, welke soorten? Oeh. Oh, maar dit is een mooie, mooie geweer. GVD, wat doe ik, chat? Deze of deze? Welke geweer gebruiken we? Mm. Wil is altijd uh, spul aan het zeggen. Ja, Vitrify? Ik hou van deze geweer. Ah, oh, ik hou ook van die andere geweer, maar ik hou van deze soort geweer ook. Ah, gee. VD. Zeg het tegen mijn gezicht, vriend. Nou, ik kan het wel doen, blauw. Ik ben het nu tenminste aan het doen. Even wachten, ik moet die kant op kijken. Zie, ik zeg dingen tegen je. Het is gewoon goede, goede tv, we zullen dat zeggen. Man, hoe kun je dat nou zeggen? Ik zou dat nooit tegen iemand zeggen. Ik hoop dat dat werkte. Nee, ik wil niet deze. Ik wil het andere. Ik wil die andere geweer. Klein pistooltje. Een kleine pistooltje. Kijk eens nou. Och. 
Wat? Vierkant op? Nou, uh, Ik weet niet wat ik moet zeggen. Ja, klein pistooltje. Jij weet wat ik zeg, Avatar. Jij weet het. Jij snapt het. Boom. Niet pistol chan. Pistooltje. En dit is chocolade donderen over en uit. When you add ch at the end of something. Like to say child, for instance, in, in Dutch is kind. Is one of the ways to say is kind. But if you want to like kind of cutesyify it, you say kindje. Of uh, meid is a way to say uh, like a younger girl, but you can also say meidje. Meidje would change it to. Um, oh god, what kind of a gun is this? Oh. I'm aware. Oh, okay, well, now I don't know what to say. Avatar, you've defeated me. Also, apologies for that little uh, hiccup at one point. That was not intentional. Just kinda. Don't you dare. Whoa, oh, Jesus! I don't know what that does. We're gonna try it. Yeah, you can't get me up here, can you, you dingus? Yes, you can. I think he's rebuttling in kind. Here. He is rebuttling in kind! <laughs> Vilcha? Uh. Woo! No. No. Uh, I mean, technically, you're not wrong, Moon. Ugh, okay, hold on. I missed a couple things. Aware Chan is a cutification in Japanese. Children aren't cute. They're evil. Not wrong, Blue. Uh, Chin. Oh, yeah, Chin. My Chin. Or My Chin. Uh, is the equivalent uh, to what you're talking about. Yep, I do believe you are correct, Avatar. Oh, I just realized that they gave me a freaking... Well, I think I killed them already, so I'm not too worried about it anymore. Don't really want the bolt, but I need another one. Just gonna have to go with this for now. Oh god, this whole map is just like, you wanna open up new avenues? Of course you do. Hey, 
1,000 reps. And L uh, Ling, hello, how's it going? Did I, if I missed you earlier, I super apologize. Yeah, you are on your own. Wait. What? Oh! How are you two doing? I haven't seen you in a long in a long while, 1000 rats. Don't you run from me. Oh. Wobbly neck. Very uncomfortable, thank you. Ah, burst rifles. Not the biggest fan. Hunt some monsters right now. Nice. Hello, and yes, I lurk. You're hella sleepy. Oh no, Ling! What's got you sleepy tonight? Uh, whoa, what was I saying? Something about... <laughs> I'm not reading that, Avatar. You can't do that to me. I refuse. I'll take this boy over the other boy. I don't like burst guns. I don't even know what... Diverting forces to assist. ETA three minutes. ETA three minutes? Oh dear. I think I need to get a move on then. Okay, those are friendly. That's friendly. Gotta keep an eye on the friendly boys. Right there, huh? Uh, I like Spanish because Ito? Is that how you would say it? Ito? Is it cute cute fies things? Belzita? Oh, it's O and A ah, depending on uh. Well, you can't read that message without context. I must have missed something. Hold on. Okay, hold on. We'll, we'll go back. I'll scan back. Uh, Same back of the ma back of the root same back roof of the mouth action. Ah, uh, all right, fair enough. Fair enough. I was missing some context. I acknowledge my mistakes and I hope that you could forgive me in the future. <laughs> Someday. Someday, Avatar, maybe you'll forgive me. Oh, they just give you a flat out just like, yeah, you can just get back through here. Uh, I think it's endearingly sweet. It's grammatically correct for anyone under <laughs> Vitrify. <laughs> but actually, Vitrify, is it Ito? Or it, an, it, an Ita? Or is it Ito? An Ita? Eto? Oh, Ito. Gotcha. So it's Ito and Ita. Oh, game, you sneaky devil. A nice way to give that helmet, actually. Just very much just like, hey, just turn around for a second. Don't worry, Vitrify. I thought it Oh, I thought it was funny. Oh my god. <laughs> I was like, man, I'm about to pay for my sins. Do I have to move it again? I must. Yeah, there it is. At least Will likes my jokes. <laughs> yeah, when they're not directed at me, they're great jokes. Any other time, though? Yeah. You know, take it or leave it, honestly. Oh. Scary combat music. Uh. Ah. Uh.
I keep forgetting about the traversal. You thought that was funny? I thought it was hilarious, Moon. What are you gonna do about it? You know, Moon, the problem with jokes is they're not always so simple and clean. Acknowledge. Kilo one four, do you copy? Come in, Kilo one four. All units, Kilo one four is not responding. Prepare to engage the target. Oh, Bells, you know I got. You're only doing it because I got to it before they did. No, you didn't. Oh, hello. What? I don't know how to feel about what just happened. I wasn't sure if I could hug the wall and be okay with it. Five minutes of ASMR. We can do five minutes of ASMR. And Stropwaffle. My goodness. There's such a vindictiveness to the to everything. Stropwaffle. Uh, so we start ASMR in three, two, one. Stropwaffle. Stropwaffle. <laughs> Stropwaffle. This is the life I live now. Did you guys know that uh, grenades can be cooked and therefore they can kill you. <laughs> you know, Vitrify, the whole reason it happened is because I was trying to read how many Stropwaffles <laughs> redeems there were. So I was trying to do two things at once and just really forgot about just the fact that the grenade is in fact a grenade. So uh, I'm going to go ahead and call that one your fault. Fake cool fact about stroke baffles. Well, let's see. You know, what's to what's to fakely say about stroke baffles? You know, a breakfast food to be certain. Uh a little uh, actually salty and well uh, though you would think they would be sweet. And of course, uh one of the worst things to eat in existence. Because they're awful. Uh, I'm sorry to hear the. Uh, sorry to say, Blue, but that's not uh, not happening. See, this was a vindictive ASMR. So, uh, therefore, there can be no sultry or seductive uh, redeems of any sort right now because there is venom in the air right now, and if you add uh seduction to venom you get toxicity and that is just not good for anybody involved you see i don't know they're chock full of vitamins and minerals <laughs> i mean i'm sure that there's something to them that's that's relatively okay to use those so uh in this case blue you can uh, blame moon for the situation right now and what's currently happening within it do we have a visual a visual we do we're taking casualties pop your head back out please come on now pop your head back out look man I just bought two packs of them alongside a pack of spinach. I was about to say spinach. I feel like I don't know what that is, unfortunately. Oh, that's so much better. Let's go. You're all dead now. was easy, wasn't it? You're still missing four stroke baffles. Oh, am I blue? 
Are you saying under normal circumstances you would have gotten seductive stropwafel then? Uh, that's not what I'm saying, uh, Bells. I'm just saying that in this particular moment, that is my justification for not saying one. I have a bit of a suspect. He's down there. Oh wow, that hits immediately. Interesting. Hey Nevek, how's it going? I'm currently in an ASMR redeem, which I should technically have the thing up right now, and I forgot to do so. So I'm gonna do that right now for the last minute. Whoops. I need to get better at that. Anyone, see where he went. Target, not in sight. No shot. Painted the walls. Doing super good. Oh. I should not be having conversations in the middle of a war zone. Let me try that again. So good. Oh, guess what? I built my new rig. Hell yeah, Nevek. I'm very glad to hear that. That's awesome. How to say <laughs> stropafel seductively? Stropafel. <laughs> That's super great, though, Novak. I'm very excited to see the results of it. Man, I wish that wasn't. Oh, there is a way to do that. I just didn't know. If you redeem two stropafels, they turn into one seductive one. That is very much incorrect. Uh, Bells, you can't just be here being a liar. That's not okay. You're supposed to be a mod. Mods don't lie. No, no, no. Well, I feel like a big thing is about to happen, so this is when I say this is Chocolate Thunder over and out. Stropwafel. And we're done. So I can turn that off again. Stropwafel. Outlink targeting module detected. Check your HUD. What? But I know it's there. Beacon 4 gantry team is KIA. Pilot may be attempting to transmit from... Oh? 216 director. The pilot's intentions are unknown. He may be attempting to draw us away from the Titan. Nine. Focus on the pilot. I have other plans for the Titan. Nine. Classic. Have yourself a good lurk, not the big boss. Thank you so much for stopping by. Oh, did I want to do that? Oh, I have team? I, I have teammates? Well, you know what? Cool, I guess. I can't tell if I'm supposed to go. Okay, well, at this time, at this point, the game is just like, just activate them. Have you have your, have your crewmates. Oh, you gotta pull it closer. Alright, I'm figuring out what's going down. Keeps giving me this, which means I'm going to be taking on a Titan soon, but I just don't want to use it. Will seductive stroke waffles be a thing, Will? Probably never, no. Because I feel uncomfortable with it feel uncomfortable saying it. <laughs> Makes me think that I'm turning into a D-Gen streamer and I'm just like, hmm. Why that step in particular? <laughs> I can't even replicate it. I feel comfortable hearing it. Oh, I see. Good. You were at the controls. Move the dish to the far right to bring it within your reach. Is he dead yet? Give me a sit -trap. Over. Richter, we need backup. The enemy pilot is still active around Beacon 4. Over. Backup? Uh, typischer IMC Schwachkopf. Sending backup. Cool. Send the backup. We're rushing. Oh. <laughs> All right, fine, we'll use it. There, he 
he's gone now. Now we can go back to the real gun. Didn't even notice that nerd going under for a second. Anybody else just witnessed that? That freaking stalker just going over and just <laughs> ing a guy? You can ban me. Why wait, wait, why the heck? <laughs> why would I ban you, Blue? I don't understand. Uh, single round. You know what? I accept it nonetheless. Sorry, friend. Under different circumstances, perhaps this wouldn't have happened. Pilot, the module is in the projector of that dish. Well, then in we go. Targeting module. Disconnected. Something bad's about to happen. Mission update. Uplink module acquired. Standing by for uh, your return cover. Uh. Entering maintenance mode. Uh. Yeah, absolutely, dude. Lafson Trifel. Squads have arrived, requesting assistance. Cheesecake, hello! How are you doing tonight? Hope that your day is treating you well so far. And it is! Thank you so much for... for coming by! I hope that life is treating you well at the moment. I did not look where I was supposed to leap. <laughs> Alright. You guys want to fucking go? Let's go. Oh, they're running? I'm engaging hostile infantry. All right. We begin. Oh! Welcome back, Cooper. Recommend we secure this area before proceeding with the repairs. Do you think? Oh, I've made a mistake. Game is being nice to me at the moment. Ooh, kinda. Good shot. Helmet. Target eliminated. You leave my boy alone. What? I don't want to go back. So everyone, one moment while I focus up a little bit. Wait. Oh, it does just go there. His All weapon away. Eliminated. Area secure. Are you okay, pilot? Barely. That was tough. Yeah, we're gonna be honest. How are you, BT? Damage report. Critical systems are functioning properly. And despite your self-evaluation, I'm certain Captain Lastimosa would have said you fought well, Cooper. Aw. Bless you, bud. 
But I'm doing fine. Thank you so much for asking, Cheesecake. Protocol 2, mission update. Replace the uplink module. The socket for the module is at the top of this dish. A throw combined with additional climbing is required. <laughs> Son of a bitch. Here we go. Give me that freaking lineup. Yeah. God. I don't know why those throws get me get me the way they do, but I appreciate the heck out of them. And right, Nivek? Best boy. Bestest boy. Alright. Oh, wow. Okay, four rounds left in that. Great. Hello? No. Bless this is Sloan. Go ahead. Sloan? Someone's been killing your mercs, and it looks like one of our radios has been nicked. I knew you shouldn't have hired those tossers. Hi, <laughs> pilot. This is Cuban Blisk. Oh, no. You've been listening to us, eh? You want to be a hero, yeah? Okay. Keep coming, Edney. Keep coming. But if I were you, I'd stop trying so hard to be a hero. You'll live, live longer. longer. We need to get a voiceover of that throw. We'll be reborn, yeet. <laughs> Go long. Oh, we're getting into the height stuff. It's fine. We can handle heights. Ooh, nice juxtaposition of blues and reds. I like that. Ooh, helmet. Won't get all the helmets this time, and I acknowledge that that's going to probably happen, but no. 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 There you go, using light again to draw our attention. Designing the upper area to be a little bit more, a uh, little bit wider, so that the way you jump, you can grab the thing you need to get to. Colors again. I'm sorry for talking my way through my or talking my thoughts out at the moment. No. Goodness gracious! Nothing special there. Hypothesis. The dish will automatically reorient itself once the new module is installed. Oh boy! That's one hell of a sound. It sounded more like screaming. Oh! <laughs> Cooper, the dish is back online. Get back here and we'll send this message to the fleet. Outstanding work. But I didn't make it. I didn't do the good. Richter, this is Bliss. The IR, I'm already on my way. Richter out. What? Are you not going to mention that, like, I'm listening in on you guys? Is that not a thing we're going to talk about? All right. Not my problem. This is Richter. Intercept and destroy that pilot. Then execute the remaining militia troops. Reapers inbound. Militia forces, lock down the control room. Threats detected. Copy 
Let's go then. Ooh, you dodgy, dodgy boys. good myself all deserve to die do they i don't think that's fair they're just trying to do their jobs dude nobody to fight though <laughs> nobody went inside hey stitches how's it going or captain stitches specifically am I did I, did I goof did I break did I whoopsie poopsie <gasps> there he is he's Don't just oh No? You look pretty done to me. Now who do we got here? Oh, is that our boy? Care to have a real fight? Let's see what you got up close and personal. I understood that last part. Kleine Junge is uh is like a little boy essentially. Let's begin. Let's begin, idiot. to do melee, eh? Let's go! Get wrecked. Easy, <laughs> easy kill. Easy clap, as some might say. Just popping in. To say good day. Well, good day to you as well, Captain Stitches. GG easy, exactly. I recommend you disembark. Well, I mean, if that's what you want me to do, if you want me to go. Chaos is functional. Grenier, fire it up. Yes, sir. Transmission sequence activated. Hell yeah. It's working. Transmission power 25% in climbing. Something's gonna happen. 60%. Almost there. 80%. Signal strength at maximum power. We are a go for transmission. Oh? Broadcasting data stream. Awaiting response. I was expecting something Here's else. Someone's still up there. Got it. This is Commander Sarah Briggs of Marauder Corps. Militia SRS. Authenticate. Commander Briggs, this is BT-7274. Protocol 2. Uphold the mission. Report intel to the fleet attached to the SRS unit. Solid copy. Good to hear you guys are still down there. We're receiving your data now. Oh, so this was a big moment. Okay. <laughs> Wait, am I just sitting on his shoulder? Your data recorder says your original pilot was KIA. Correct. 
Captain Ty Lastimosa was killed in action. It's true. I am now linked to an acting pilot, Rifleman Jack Cooper. Hello. Wait a minute. Lastimosa linked you to a rifleman? Yep. Yes. He had no other options. It's true. Understood. We'll get you transferred to a fully qualified pilot. Excuse me? Objection. Cooper is my pilot. Our combat effectiveness rating now exceeds 90%. Request permission to retain this link. Go ahead. You're lucky our backs are up against the wall, BT. Permission granted. What do you mean, lady? High praise coming from a machine, Cooper. Thanks to your scan data of the Ark, we've tracked its energy signature to an IMC base right here on Typhon. We don't have much time. Let's go. I don't like Sarah. I don't like her. <laughs> she's not even rude to Machine Boy. She's just literally just like, yeah, like, we need you to have a proper pilot. It's just like, bitch, I have carried a portion of this. I am responsible for the information that you guys have. What do you mean I'm not a competent pilot? <laughs> I'm so mad right now. Hey, Gwen, how's it going? Fake cool fact about you. Corporeal. <laughs> of the physical sort. Alive. <laughs> These are the three fake things that I would use to describe Gwen, the blanket specter. <laughs> also, how are you doing, Gwen? I hope that you're doing good. But yeah, heck, Sarah. She's a butt. Wow, Captain Stitches, you being you being you being mighty aggressive over there. Trial by fire. Yee -hee. Listen up. The IMC have developed a fold weapon. It has the power to destroy entire worlds, but without its power source, the Ark, it is inoperable. Your mission is to capture the Ark before it can leave the airbase. Marauder Corps, weapons hot! Oh, frick yes. But, like, my stream is over. Don't do this to me now. We're about to end the stream. Get to cover, pilot. We're taking down that wall. Gosh dang it. Fine. We're going a little bit longer. Gosh dang it! Let's go! Hey Sarah, remember when I was a really bad pilot and you were gonna replace me? And now I'm almost single-handedly taking on the opponents at the moment? I should really be careful with what I'm saying, because I could really die right now. <laughs> I need to use that dash way more often. Pretty sure I got caught on one of the other AI. 
Oh, I'm so bitter. <laughs> I'm so bitter right now. Fine. Round two, let's go. Sarah was right. Embarrassing. Dashing towards the stuffs. Yum, yum. Get bonked, nerd. Oh my god, how are you supposed to dodge that? <laughs> Explain it to me. All right, you know what? We'll switch to a different over. Uh, we'll switch to a different layout. That's what we got to do. This worked well earlier. Oh hell yes. Oh my god! Third time's a charm? Ooh, yeah, that laser makes it kinda hot, huh? Yeah, apparently. I'm bad. <laughs> Alright. We'll play a different approach. We'll try something else. Let's ignite. Rockets. Let's try this boy. Badger six, take the sideline. Laser board ready. Keep moving, that ship can take off at any moment. There. You want fucking lasers? Don't get in my way! That we got health back. Oh, why? Fine, we'll just punch through it. Hit the guy beside me, then I don't care. Laser. Back in. Pretend you're shooting Sarah. <laughs> That's what I should have done the whole time, Blue. Oh, we gotta finish that boy off with a punch. There we go. Oh god. 
What is that thing? How can you use this so often? Shoulder mounted later, so OP! What the heck? Which remark? Lock this area down. BT, Pilot Cooper, you're with me. Let's go. Watch out, IMT Titans up ahead. Go, go, go! Hostile Titan in sight. Take him out. Alright, we got this, boys and girls. Apologies for not being able to see chat at the moment. Can I blow those up? No? You should. You little bastard. Sarah, you're in the way! Nice shot, Pilot Cooper. We need to keep moving. Oh, what is that nice shot? I'm playing I'm doing well. I'm sorry, Sarah. Could you say that again? Let me deal with these guys for a second. Sorry, where are you, Sarah? I need to have a word with you for a moment. Where the heck did she go? Also, there are areas on the side that I feel like I should be exploring. Okay, that's just the empty room. Classic empty room. I'm just doing it for the hahas, I promise. Take those titans out, pilot. Move it, pilot. Move it. Oh, you're Enemy just on the other side. Oh. No, BT, I need you. Hostile titan. I think we have a beam ready already, so we just hit him right for the beam. Yes, I'm being this guy right now. Watch out, we've got more company. Yeah, I saw him already. I just don't know exactly where he went. I guess. All right, Outlaw, you've got my attention. I would hope I have your attention. I'm shooting at you. I'm literally just slicing your health bar apart. You're gonna find your warning. 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 I blame Sarah for that miss. I mean, that was one dude, Sarah. You just got beamed. Hell yeah, my dude. Follow me. There's a lift up ahead. Come on, pilot. Follow me. What? I'm right here. Also, Briggs sounds familiar. Well, you're doing a good job, Cooper. As far as I'm concerned, you've earned your pilot certification. Oh no, that let's not be petty. They they're they're warming up to us. Now, we we need to allow that. Ooh. Yoink. We have North Star. The plasma railgun. Oh good lord. It's a sniper rifle. All right, we got mines that lock nearby targets down. That's pretty sweet. The cluster rockets. Hover core? Hover. Unleash rockets at enemies below. Justice reigns from above. Are you in and sleeps? Hey, Pom Pom, welcome back. There she is. We still have time to intercept the arc. Why don't we just fucking start... Putting bullets into her. Move, move! Incoming hostiles! Why did I shoot Sarah? I knew that I saw the name. And I still shot her. Because I'm stupid. Oh, 
god, this is a slow weapon. Let's try this flight mode while we're at it. Alright, that was pretty cool, I guess. Alright, but we are... Ah. Say, I didn't like... I want to switch. Going back to Ion. Ion has this kind of winning me over, really. Windows up, baby! Wow, could have waited a few seconds before. Doing what I was doing, huh? A Freudian action? Yeah, you're probably right. Guys. Is that Sarah? Okay, it wasn't Sarah. They are fine. Get caught in that corner then. March towards them. We're not afraid. Militia tighten down. down? How? We're doing so well. Guys. We lighten up. Looks like we lit up what we needed to light up. Keep we'll marching. Keep going. Oh, goodness. One day I'll let my gun reload. Oh wait. Oh, the power of freaking forward dashing. going. I don't think they know what's up. Back to Ion. All militia forces, move in on the Draconis. Vanguard class tighten in sight. Engage Oh, that's a teammate. I'm sorry, teammate. No. <laughs> All right, lads, let's go. All right, Vitrify, be honest with me. How close am I to the end right now? Because this is a big set piece. Oh, 
Jesus. Okay, maybe I'm a little bit, uh, maybe I'm a little far ahead here. I didn't have the freaking shields for it. <laughs> I used them all earlier for a pointless moment. Ah, oh, dang it. Ah, bad choice on my part. All right, we're back in it. Final launch checks complete. All systems go. They're taking off. Hello? We need to get to that ship. Uh-oh. Oh, my Q button is not working. Done. I need to see. Oh, that's not good. My game broke and it's not letting me use Q for whatever reason. Well, I'm just gonna get myself killed. I need a refresh. Come on, nerds. Thank you. If I can't use Q, I'm probably not gonna win this fight, because, uh,. Ion, can I use it? Oh god, I still can't use it. What is happening? Shit. Ugh, this is gonna be one of those I'm probably gonna lose a lot of... A lot of progress having to restart. That would be very irritating. It will not let me use Q. I don't know why. Yes, thank you, game. I can only use my... Wait a second, I have an idea. Got it. Do I just got out and got back in again? I restarted, if you will. Oh, it's right here. I've done enough troubleshooting in my time to. Not gonna hold off against me, nerd. Final launch checks complete. All systems go. No. They're taking off. We need to get to that ship. Don't let them get away. Don't let them get away. Get to that ramp. <gasps> Wait, why wouldn't Listen we just slow? The arc is headed your way. I'll let Viper take it from here. See you soon. Oh. Why didn't we just shoot it? Get to a ship. We're going after him. Why the heck are you guys just sending me smiley faces? Okay, so we're not done yet. All right. Great set piece, though. Holy shit, did that feel satisfying. Like, difficult. But that can you guys stop, please? <laughs> Infuriating. All right, well, in that case, we're going to, well, depending on what happens when I hit spacebar, we're going to be stopping here for the night. Oh, just a rocket launcher. Taking it to the fold weapon on board the Draconis. All ships, flank speed. We have.
have to hit them hard and fast. Breaks out. Copy that. Six more on run. Why are we going faster than the rest? This is Captain Diaz of the Braxton. We'll provide a support platform. Are those good? Are those bad? Enemy I... squadron in sight. Lock archers. We've got the drop on them. Light them up. Fuck two. Fuck two. Dissel up the rail. Flash one. Flash two. Good hit. Good hit. Confirm splash on all trail units. Why'd I even fa bother firing Just then? Burn past it. We have to catch the Draconis. I got an unidentified bogey at 11 o'clock. What the hell is that? Anyone got a clear visual? Airborne bogey required. Oh. Oh dear. Hello. Oh. Oh, good God. Brace yourself. Oh, God. BT. Nice of you to show up. You're welcome. I don't know who Barker is. Guarding the Draconis. We can't get past it. Cooper, I need a pilot on board the Malta to secure the deck now. Are you about to throw me? Copy that, 64. Oh my god, they're doing it. Let's do it. Cooper, get ready. No. This is where we stop. We're starting again. We're gonna hit right off here next Tuesday. <laughs> yeah, that's right. Cliffhanger. <laughs> What's wrong, Vitrify? How much gameplay is left? Be honest with me. Well, that's why I'm asking, Evertar. I'm be I'm being cautious about this. Oh goodness, my uh, everything is breaking apparently. Yes, I get it, pillows. Holy heck. About an hour and a half to two hours. That's a stream. Perfect. <laughs> All right. Well, then in that case, still quite a bit. Uh, I was tempted to lie about it. I know you were vitrifying. I appreciate that you didn't because... I would have no energy by the end of this stream, and I would not want to do that to myself. <laughs> I'm still trying to keep a schedule going. Besides, this is a great place to stop. That means we're immediately going to jump into the action next time. We're going to get yeeted. We're going to probably deal with uh, Viper, although apparently Viper's really difficult. So chances are he's probably going to kick my ass a couple of times before before we move forward. I mean, I died a couple times to the freaking charge in the... You know, charging the wall and trying to get to the gate, so. Would not surprise me if it would be uh, difficult through and through from this point on. But. Thank you guys so much for sticking around. We're going to go ahead and take a peek at who we can raid right now. Viper more like diaper. Frickin' got him, Blue. Alright, manage pulls. Alright, where? Where go? Apologies for no music at the moment. Alright, we can go like a dragon. We can go and see Kirby. We can go and see Dragon Age 2. Hiccup. Or we can see my friend Peldro. All right, poll is up. Thank you for stream. Thank you guys for being here. Holy shit. Again, a big, you know, hat tip to Vitrify for suggesting Titanfall 2. It has been awesome. <laughs>
like, depending on how this game ends, this might be one of those games that I might revisit, like, once a year. Ah, uh, ending. Hey, Luna D. Yeah, we are just finishing up. We're on a we're on another big set piece, so we're uh, I've decided that we should we should go for a pause, so that we have one more stream by the sound of it uh, next Tuesday, which will be very exciting. Sorry, my brain is also just short circuiting for a second there, and was just like. Did the poll go through? Did any of that happen? I am confused. Derp, 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 derp. Kirby! Overwhelmingly so. All right, ladies and gentlemen, then we are going to go to Cobalt VT. He's only just started, so this is a perfect time to jump in. Let me just take a peek really quickly. Oh, my goodness. Ads. <sighs> Am I right, fellas? Oh, it looks like he's just picking a new world. So we're just going to jump in right as he's getting started. Perfect. All right. Then in that case, if you are subscribed, please use the top right message. If you are just following, please use the bottom right message. Thank you guys so much for sticking around. That was that was a very good time. I don't even remember. Did I even stream on Saturday? I can't remember. Days are just blurring by. Earlier today, about two uh, to about three hours before stream, I was just like, "Man, it's gonna be great streaming tomorrow." And then I realized I had to stream today. Like it's just blah, 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 blah. did not stream Saturday, right? I was editing. All right, well, in that case, to sign us off really quickly before we go say hi to Cobalt, uh, thank you guys so much for sticking around. Whether you were chatting, whether you were lurking, whether you were just in and out for a second, know that you were super appreciated. I hope that you're having a great day, afternoon, evening, or night, whatever time might happen to be for you. I hope that you're taking care of yourselves. I hope that you're drinking plenty of water. And when you finally do sleep, whatever time that might be for you, I hope that you have a very restful sleep. As you can hear, my brain is starting to short circuit and fry. I apologize. I will see you guys over at Cobalt, and I will see you guys next time for Mirror's Edge on Thursday. See you guys then. More parkour!